Hey y'all, so uh, it is Monday, okay? It is Monday. It is January 16th, whatever it is. So, got the track meet coming up in five days, right? It's going to be uh, Saturday up in Birmingham. And I just want to do good, but today we're going to go ahead and practice. It feels, it's windy outside again. Like I said, the first track meet I had like two days ago was outside i had a 762 with a 1.2 headwind so if you was to take that out and if i was to run inside that would have been a 750 instead not a 762 but uh, that's what we're going with so my second ever 60 meters will be this week at a uh, birmingham at the sanford invite i kind of man i swear to god like i'll be having it like set in my head in my cranium in my cranium you know but what i'm gonna do today is i'm gonna probably do Starting again, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna do starting blocks. So I'm gonna do that four times, and then I'm gonna give myself a 10 minute rest. And I'm going to do. I want to do. I wanted. I want to do two 80s, and end it with a 50. You know, that's what I want to do. So I'm gonna probably do four starting blocks, give myself 10 minutes rest, then two 80s, and then 150. Like a like a 150, like not like 50 meters, but a 50 meters. Like I'm probably not gonna go 100. percent I should probably turn it around. I should probably do the 150 first and then the 280s. But that's what we're looking at. We're gonna be doing a distance training. I mean, well, speed endurance training, I should say, for the 60 meters. So that's what we're gonna look. That's what we're looking at right now. So I'll see y'all. Hey y'all, what's up? Alright, so I'm hitting out with a little voiceover and I'm letting the first video play with Win. Just to let y'all know that I did have Win. I didn't put the mic on uh, because, well, I wasn't vlogging at the moment. I was just setting the camera down. But I had to hurry up because they're finna start track practice. And uh, I kind of got away. But just letting y'all know it was windy out there. And I am happy with the 30 meter results I got. We're gonna go with it, as you can tell. That's my, this is my first one. First one's always a little sluggish, but got a 409. Happy to, with the results, but yeah, when I was over there, we were just talking about like the meet. They asked me about my meet, asked them about theirs. They kind of rambled about theirs anyways, talking about, uh, they said like only Mississippi State, Jackson State, South Alabama was there. I was like, that's better than my meet. All I had was NAI schools. Like I just had the private college schools at mine, <laughs> but hopefully it's a little better to Sanford uh, invite this weekend. I'll be going there. And then, as far as I'm concerned, the next one I have, and by the way, y'all put in the uh, comment section below, I've been watching a lot of track vlogs, some people have been hitting me up on mine, and so it's pretty cool to just talk to people from, most of the people that I've been talking to actually live in the South too, so that's kind of funny, but anyways, um, this right here is the second one, and I got a 406. Like I said, I just feel lighter. Even though I walk up the stairs at my place, I feel a whole lot lighter. Even though I weigh about the same. Right now, I'm like at 204. I was at 202, but I got back up to 204. I don't know how, but it happened. So hopefully I can get down to 203 tomorrow. I just want to get below 200 pounds. But I was telling them how somebody was like, you look like a football player as long as at my check meet. 60. And they are asking me, am I going to do any other events? If I do any other events, it won't be this year. I'm going to strictly probably just stick to the 60 meters and the 100 meters. I might do a 200. I might, but I don't know. I'm not really confident in doing a 200 yet. I haven't even timed myself, but I would do like some more distance training. I would do like, I would have to do like 350s and stuff, but that's my third 40 meter right there. I mean, not 40 meter, 30 meter. Uh, got another 406. But anyways, I'll be at the LSU Twilight on the 17th. I'm trying to find a meet on the 4th that's close here, but... The one that, that that is available, mm, I don't know. I don't, I don't want to go to Birmingham twice in a row. You know what I'm saying? So I might skip that one because, you know, I do work on the weekends, on some weekends. So there's some weekends I'll be working. That's why I have, like, a gap between each meet. Like, meet, gap, meet, gap, meet, gap. So, um, so that, that was my last one right there, 397, 399. I know I said I was going to do a 150, but I actually changed it. So I didn't record it uh, just simply because – I was doing on the, I was doing on the curves and I don't have anybody. I didn't, I wasn't gonna ask them to like hold my camera. They need to warm up, but I basically just did two backwards one hundreds just to work on specific leg muscles. So I did two backward one hundreds on the curves and that was the end of the workout. So uh, 
that's really all I did. And now let's get back to the original content. All right, y'all, we back. It's Friday. It's uh, April. <laughs> it's April. It's January the 20th. Um, I didn't record my practice from Tuesday cause, simply because I just didn't feel like it, honestly. But I did starting again. So I did I did three. I only did like three starts, 30-meter uh, starts. And then I did four hundreds at a 400-meter pace. I did uh, two straight 100. So, like, I did 100. Then I, uh, oh, don't mind the turban, but uh, I did a hundred, walked the curve, did a hundred, like did a hundred, 400 meter pace. I had all my trainers as well, kind of messed up. I should have put on spikes because uh, my shin, like this one right here. I don't know, man. Shin, I was like, nah, I don't want to get shin splints, but it's always my right leg. But anyways, yeah, so I did that. And then your boy uh, switched it up. So I did the 100 on the curve. And then I walked in a hundred curve when I was done. So I did four one hundreds at four hundred meter pace and thirty. I mean three thirty meter sprints. So fast forward, I didn't practice Wednesday. I didn't practice Thursday. I'm not practicing today. I got a race Saturday. And speaking of racing, I'm doing a video on Terrence Laird, so I'm finna work on that. But um, that will come out before me saying this comes out. But man, all right. So I want to show y'all the heat list real quick. And I don't have my uh, the little thing that you put under the camera, like to hold your camera. I don't know why I didn't do that, but uh, I don't talk about the little tripod holder. Anyways, so it's gonna focus. Boom. All right, so let's do this real quick. So here's what happened, Mr. Roddy here. He sent the email, and y'all can read if you want to. So. Yeah, so the fact that we had to start at 10, 20 a.m., I don't really like that. That's kind of early for the prelims, but I'm in heat nine. So I'll probably be racing around like 12, I mean 10, 50. So I, got, so I think Birmingham is, let's see how far Birmingham is from me. Three hours and 14 minutes from where I'm at right now. So I'm going to definitely leave at like 4 a.m. to 5 a.m. I just seem like that's that's just realistic. So here goes the heats. You can pause it if you want to. But that's heat one. And I'll be racing with Bill again. So those guys were at my last meet. Grambling's in Louisiana. Never heard of shorter. I know I I heard of Morehouse. That's a that's a black school. Hey, that's HBCU. I believe it's in Georgia. I don't know. Tyler, I never heard of that school either. Never heard of that school. William Carey is here in Hattiesburg, uh, Alabama State. So the name, Mississippi University of Women, Meridian. So we have a bunch of schools in Mississippi. We got Mississippi College, Meridian, which is in here in Mississippi, Mississippi University of Women, Mississippi. William Carey in Terry Hattiesburg, Mississippi. Uh, Xavier, Louisiana is going to be there. Uh, some William Baptist, I don't know where that's at. Rhodes, I don't know where that's at. But these are just the heats. Bell Haven, that's here in Mississippi. So a bunch of Mississippi schools are going to be at the uh, Sanford Invite. Sutter, that's SWAC. That's in a, a... Huh. I think Sutter's in Baton Rouge. What's in Baton Rouge? I think Sutter's in Baton Rouge. LSU is in Baton Rouge. And SCLU is kind of close to Baton Rouge, like in Hammond. No. Um, so here goes Heat 6. JSU. You know, Jackson, you already know about them. That's Coach Prong. Well, it was. He's in Colorado now. <laughs> this is Heat 7. Heat 8. I just wanted to show y'all because one of y'all might be watching my track meet, I mean, video, so that would be cool. Oh, by the way, this guy has the same name as me, Justice Trainer. Like, just spelled the same, so I thought that was pretty cool. All right, I haven't really met too many people with the same name as me. Probably, like, four, like, in person. I think I met, like, three overall but this but like seeing that is pretty cool and then there's my heat and i'll be racing mobile when carry williams baptist cumberland hans and jackson state bro that's so disrespectful bro they put me <laughs> they put me in the middle of two guys that run a 687 and a 685 that's so disrespectful. They couldn't put me by Brian. <laughs> they couldn't put me by Byron at least. You know what though? That's gonna help me though. So 
uh, look forward for a PR. <laughs> look forward for a PR tomorrow. I'm aiming at 650. <laughs> I know it's not funny, but dang, man, they really put me in, in the middle. And I see these guys times. These guys run like 10, like 1070s or whatever. I'm like, bro, these guys run a whole more than a whole second faster than me. I don't know about right now though, but that's crazy. Hey, I was. Hey, I was up. It's me. Everything track. Uh, turn the heat off. It's uh five in the morning now. I've been up since like four. Uh, I got me some breakfast right now, so I'm finna go ahead and eat. I don't know if you can all can see that. I make myself a cup of strawberries. So I said, make myself a cup of strawberries. Um, I'm gonna eat a cup of strawberries as well, like on the way to Birmingham. But like I said, I've been up since uh, 4.20. I already took a shower. I got my backpack ready. Um, we finna eat right now. I'm waiting for her so she can eat too. Uh, but that's where we're at right now. Actually, I need to put my watch on and I think about it. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and eat and I'll catch up with y'all later. So uh, that's what we're looking like right now. Just your normal sausage two pancakes and three strawberries for now so uh yeah and by the way i'm gonna make this clear right now we are going to record the races so we're definitely going to get uh, some of the women's 60 meters and the men's 60 meters uh so besides my race being recorded we're gonna record at least like maybe like three of each i guess we can go from there all right y'all we in alabama just made it. Sweet home Alabama! But yeah, we, we out here in Alabama though. So uh, we still got like an hour or something to get to Birmingham. So uh, I'll see y'all there. And we're on the way. Dudu, the winner from Cumberland. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like lane seven. And that is Brianna Charles. Hines Queen Pop. Looks like a lane four. On a map. Her time seven seventy. Seven oh two. Looks like lane three across the line. That would be Victor Smith of Alabama State running six, seven. Let's go, 
So we back. Uh, uh, man. So just got done running my first uh, 60. And y'all just saw the video. Y'all just saw what I did. Horrible. First ever 60 indoor. Like, remember the one last week was an indoor meet, but it was outside. So this was the first ever 60 and a 774. Oh, my gosh, bro. That was so nasty. That was so nasty. Like, me watching it. All right, so I knew I messed up. I'll tell y'all real quick because uh, the video's going to be long as it is. I'll tell y'all what happened real quick. First of all, when I was on the uh, on the blocks, my feet weren't full. All right, how can I put this? All right, so, by the way, we're winning right now. We're beating uh, JMU, James Madison, 73 to 58. I don't know if you can see it. I don't have the camera pointing me, but I'm watching us play real quick. Uh, we're winning right now, 75 to 58. So I'm watching us. I was going to go over there, but I said, forget, I got to edit these videos. I got stuff to do. But anyways, what happened was my foot wasn't fully on the blocks, both of them. And I knew that before. I, like, I I tried to put it right, but I hate being left-footed because I feel like I take so much time and I'm a nuisance on everybody. So my feet weren't fully planted on the uh, blocks. But overall, I was in a seat where everybody was literally in the sixes. So I was set up for failure. <laughs> Oh, uh, I just thought I was going to do better than last week, and that's crazy that I didn't. I don't – me watching myself, Um, I just think that was – that was. I'm, I'm sorry, I watched a basketball game. I just think that was a bad race. That was just a bad race, me watching myself. I ran slower than yesterday, and yesterday was like windy with a headwind. So I don't know what the heck happened, to be real with y'all. I don't know. Um, Obviously, I know I need to work on, though. Uh, I need to work on – I still need to work on my start. They had way better. Now, now, now that I have something recorded, I actually have me being recorded against people that run a 60 and the sixes. So now I see the difference. Now I can actually study the difference between me and them. The start was way better. They had a way better start than me around the get-go. I ain't going to lie, the blocks kind of uh, didn't do me any justice for that because I did mess up on the blocks. I didn't really set my blocks up the way I wanted to. I did want more of a higher angle. It was more lower. So I kind of messed myself up with that. So that's my fault. Also, I need to work on my acceleration because that needs work. That definitely needs work, my acceleration. And I just need to work on being able to hold my peak speed. So I need to do some speed endurance and more acceleration work. I probably need to stop working on the, uh, I keep working on my start too much and I'm not focusing on the other important aspects of the 60. So I'm definitely going to work on that. And uh, my, my next race, I'm taking a little break uh, because that was trash and boo-boo. So <laughs> first first ever 60 meters indoors ever, uh, 774. Uh, overall, my best is a 762 from last week, though. But what we're going to do is we're going to huh. – yeah, well, anyways, what we're going to do is we're just going to keep working on it the start but we're going to keep we're going to work on endurance and uh speed and like speed endurance and acceleration work and holding my uh speed because i lack some things if y'all just saw that video i need to lose weight like i'm getting sick of like looking at everybody everybody's like 150 and i'm here here i am 200 something pounds and i think that that also plays a big factor having to carry all this weight like all this muscle and stuff it just it just plays another big factor but anyways my next meet will be in uh, LSU February 17th. So 
That'll be my next and last indoor meet. Will be in LSU, which is a whole lot closer to me. I'd rather drive to Baton Rouge than Birmingham any day. Birmingham ain't that bad. That's a three-hour job, but LSU's like two, so that's a whole extra hour cut off. So I could definitely do that. So yeah, that's where we're at right now. Though uh, I won't be racing until February 17th, so I have less than a month. But I'm gonna be working super, like super hard, like on certain aspects of the race that I need to be working on. But with that being said, I have more. I have like two videos that just came out. This vlog be the last video for today. Mm, maybe the last video for today. We gonna see. I wanna beat on my Xbox. I wanna play some Star Wars. But uh, <laughs> I'll see y'all later though. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later. All right, peace.